They're often naive people, and people generally start out naive who'd been betrayed. You know, and they, they regarded their loss of naivety as an increment in wisdom. And, and you see this with cynical people, right? And they think, well, I was naive and I got burned and uh, that's not gonna happen again. And it's like, fair enough, that actually is an increment in wisdom, but you're in the desert at that point, right? I mean, the naivety wasn't a virtue and the collapse is a catastrophe, but the place you end up with is not positive. But you're not gonna say, well, I'm not gonna drop my cynicism and go back to being naive. So then, well, what's the alternative to the cynicism that's induced by malevolence? And the answer to that is something like, it's something like courageous trust. Well, I know perfectly well that you're full of snakes, but I'm going to extend my hand anyway, based on the faith that if you have the courage to do that, that the being that you will call out of the other person is thereby rendered most likely to be of the upward stumbling type.